What's up, y'all? What's up? What's up? What's up? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Make sure y'all join the crew. It's me and you, Big Stump Before 2-2. Two, two. Wee! I'm coming with y'all with a, you know, with another video for my red skin fans out there, you feel me? Um, I want y'all to know that, hey, I'm here. I'm here to take care of business. I want y'all to share it out, tweet it out, tell people about this um channel. Hey, we here, man. Make sure y'all watch the full. Y'all would love to watch the full entire video, man. I would love that mostly. You feel me? And um, this is y'all see the title. Y'all see the title. Um, make sure y'all do it big, do it simple. Join the crew. It's me and you, big simple four two two. We lit up in this joint, y'all. Now, okay, let's get it, man. Let's get it. Now, y'all see the title, man. <laughs> it's about it's about these, you know, these people talking about, you know, our schedule changing, you feel me? Our schedule, you know, is easy. And, you know, a lot of people talking about it, you know, saying, hey, Hey, some people got different opinions. Some people got ten. Uh, you know, some it uh, well me, <laughs> ten and six. You know, that's me. You know, some people got six and ten. Some people got five and eleven. That's for that. You know, everybody got a different opinion. You feel me? But the reason why, you know, I want to give y'all my reasons why I said ten and six. Okay, now. It, it, and, and the whole thing about it, this, this you, you know, this whole, this whole thing about predictions, it, it gets to, it, it gets to a lot of people. You feel me? And I feel like Redskins right now. I feel like Redskins can do something. You feel me? I really do. You know, it's a different, it's a different team, it's a different organization, but only the owner. But everything is different. You feel me? And, you know, I know everything. Got You got to work with things. You got to see how it's going to work in the first year and all that. I know this. I know this, man. Um, But I feel like I feel like 10 and 6 is a good, decent number. And at the end of the day, you you can't even say, you know, I say this. I say this. You feel me? The people that, you know that does you know the predictions on the on the schedule i feel like you know anything can happen now you feel me anybody anybody can make it to the playoffs now you feel me with that seven seed means somebody can go seven and nine maybe six and ten at best in the playoffs you feel me or or maybe you know eight and eight nine and seven because that seven seed is going to be something to watch. Everybody know that. You know, that's going to be something to watch. Because actually, if you think about it, we could have went so many times with an 8-8 eight and eight record back then. And it's ridiculous, you know. But you got to think, though. You got to think. It's a lot of things that can happen this year. You feel me? When it comes down to scheduling. You know, when you look at the schedule, you say, oh, man, they go win there, they go win there. You know, they go, you know, they go something, you know. Okay, okay, we, we might lose that one. Yeah, yeah, you're going to get those predictions. You feel me? you definitely going to get those predictions. But at the end of the day, I feel like Redskins, Redskins going to do well this year. And the part of me of saying that, you feel me, because... I see some things that that can that that can be worked on, like the quarterback position. A lot of people feel like the quarterback position is going to be the main focal point of this season for the Redskins. A lot of people, you feel me? That's that's just us. We want to see the quarterback succeed. We want to see Dwayne Haskins succeed, so we don't have to worry about the quarterback position no more. Now, when you think about it. I feel like when you when you have a quarterback that that you can really trust in, you can have a franchise, and that's a true statement. You feel me? That's a true statement. Now, 
you got to have a quarterback. You got to have it now. Now our history, in our history, you feel me? We had three. We had three quarterbacks that won the Super Bowl back then. You feel me? That was a long time ago. You feel me? But in this generation, everybody feels like you got to have that that main quarterback. You feel me? That main quarterback that's going to take you all the way every time. When when it when when you think when you think the season is over, you got a quarterback that's going to actually you know take it. You feel me? And say, nah, nah, this season ain't over. If if you like five and six and you know you got a great quarterback, oh yeah, you gonna you gonna believe in that quarterback. Everybody know this, you feel me? I'm looking at what what this schedule is all about. Now the schedule is saying, you know, we 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 I mean we we got a lot of work to do. I know. I know. Everybody talking about we got the top, we we can have the top ten, maybe top top five defense, all that. But I like to see stuff on the field. That's just me. You feel me? I, I that's that's me all day. That is me. I like to see stuff on the field. I want to see what they're gonna do. You feel me? So at the end of the day, I gotta see what I want to see. That you know that's gonna really. Help me actually see what's going to happen. You know, if y'all get what I mean right there. I'm saying, you know, Redskins, Redskins, you know, defense, defensive-wise, I feel like it can lead us to, you know, good things. It can lead us to good things. Now, offensive-wise, we got, we got pieces. People, don't sleep on our pieces, you feel me? A lot of people... It, a lot of people is faking on our pieces that we picked up in free agency and in the and in the draft. People feel like we got a couple of steals in the draft. You feel me? But I really love what we done this off season. Not going after big profile names like we had back then. You feel me? It was it was good back then, but I don't want to see it no more. You feel me? If it didn't work. You feel me? You got it. You got to go with a different plan. That's how it is. That's how it is. A lot of people were stuck in the old routine and all that other stuff. We we don't want to see that. We don't want to see that no more. We just want to see our team actually play well and and see our team actually get somewhere. You feel me? We want to see our team actually progress on a lot of things. You feel me? Like offensive line, we got we got we we got to think about those. Now, offensive line, you got to think about it. it. I think it can be a good offensive line. You feel me? Plug here, plug there. You feel me? You never know. You feel me? But at the end of the day, you got to look. You got to definitely look. You know? I like I like what the Redskins are doing, man. I really do. Now, 10 and 6 is something that I really want to look at. You feel me? I think... I think we can go ten and six. I think we can, but I, you know, in this in this division, three almost two teams probably will come out of it. We know this. I know this. I think Redskins will pull it off. It. They will pull off it, man, and win ten games this year. And and why they working on those things? Why they working through it? They gonna see themselves right there in the mix of a playoff berth. You feel me? And we all see that. We all see that. Now, some people don't see it, but I see I see a few things that 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 can be worked or worked on right away. You feel me? If they have a little bit of training camp, you feel me? You gotta look through it. You gotta look through the team. You gotta see what they have. I see what they have, man. And it's it's some good talent out there, man. It's some good good talent. And I'm looking at it. Wide receiver wise, we got the youngest wide receiving core right now in this league. You feel me? I feel like we got the youngest wide receiving core. Yeah, I, I might have to look that up or something, but I think we got the youngest wide receiving core. You feel me? But at the end of the day, you gotta look at what what we have at running back. I feel like we can run the ball. If we can run the ball, to if we can run the ball and keep it. You know, keep it at bay with Dwayne Haskins. We can work on Dwayne Haskins bit by bit. But if we can run the football, 
it, it changes the whole game. You feel me? If you run the football, you don't have to pass the ball all throughout the throughout the game. You feel me? Run the football. Keep the game in your hands. If you got the game in your hands, not tr you ain't trying to you ain't trying to you know make it seem obvious. You feel me? That we we trying to run the football, but yeah, we trying to run the football. I think our team should be based off running the football and scheme wise. You feel me? If, if Dwayne Haskins got to work on this game bit by bit. That's what we have to do. Now, I feel like at 10 and 6, it's something that we got to look at. And I'm saying, oh my goodness, the schedule is set for us, man. The schedule is so set, it's unbelievable. The schedule is set, man. And I can't believe it that I'm watching this, you know. 10 and 6, y'all. 10 and 6. If we don't go 10 and 6, you know. I just had to, you know, eat, eat the crow. I got to eat the crow. But I feel like we, we should go 10-6. I feel it. But back then, back then when I made my, my predictions back then, it was a true statement. Hey, we, was going, we was going like 3-13 and 13 or something like that. You know, that's how I was, you know, that's how it, everybody was feeling that way last year. Everybody, everybody knew Jay Gruden was going out the door and everything, everything. Bruce Allen, all of them. We knew this. You feel me? We knew it. How you had drama in the first week of this season? Hey, come on, y'all. Y'all know this. Now, like, how you have, how you have, how you have first drama on the first week of the, of the season, you sat down Adrian Peterson against the Eagles. And I believe we would have won that game if we had Adrian Peterson in that game. Now, I'm just saying, we, we almost won that game. Now, we facing the Eagles again. But this time it's switched around that we at home. We at home doing this, all right? And I feel good about where we at when we at home against the, against the Eagles. I'm feeling good, you know, but now it's changing, man. I feel good. I feel good about where, where the Redskins are leading up to, and I feel good where, where we're going to head to, you feel me? So let's have some fun, man. Let's have some fun. Let's do it big, do it simple. Um, that's my reason why I said tick and 10 and 6 for my um, prediction, and I want to give a huge shout-out to my man. My man, my man, History 21 History, his link will be down in the description box. I need y'all to go check his channel out. You feel me? Go check his channel out. We're going to have a ball, y'all. Make sure y'all go ahead, share, share, like, comment, subscribe. Come on through. And you know, Redskins Nation, this is how we do. We doing it big and we doing it simple. See y'all later, man. Peace. What's up, y'all? It's your boy, Big Simple 422. Make sure y'all go ahead and check out History 21 History. I'ma tell y'all we're gonna do a big door simple. Go to his channel because we getting. Uh -huh.